Hey, it's looking today, everybody. This is Sports Fan News. I'm going to be a quick video on the Dodgers, who continue to have a heck of an offseason, as obviously they bring in the big basher, Freddie Freeman, who comes in and is already in that lineup that is absolutely loaded with Mookie Betts and others, obviously, down the entire lineup. Will Smith, that catcher. And they also bring in one of the better contact rate underrated hitters in the game as well as Han in Hans or Alberto to be a bench bat for their team as well. So they're filling out the depth plus getting big money players and a guy that'll probably be a very good fifth starter for them in Danny Duffy, who is of course is a good location pitcher that has very good breaking ball when he's on his money. And he was a pretty good pitcher um, throughout his entire career when healthy his big thing is just as long as he can give you the innings, he usually gives you pretty damn good innings. So the Dodgers continue to have a heck of a offseason sign for the Freeman, six years, $162 million. And they also signed Shane Green to a minor league contract, two guys that uh, I believe Shane Green might have played a little bit with the Braves, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, either way, a guy that has been a good relief pitcher at times in his career, and as I've said in other videos, relief pitchers and so up and down, that as long as you have the stuff, if it's the right coaching there, and the Dodgers have obviously got the most out of relievers, then you can get the most out of them. So that's an interesting signing for them. Freeman, absolute money signing, A++++ plus plus plus, uh, for that signing. One of the best hitters in the league, power hitting and also contact hitting. And then also getting Mike Wright to see if they can make him into a solid reliever and a guy that has some pop in Jake Lamb, if they can get him back to being more of a guy that can run into the ball more so he can take advantage of having that pop and not have as bad of a swing and miss rate, then... <clears throat> they can be in pretty good business there. Plus, they also brought in Yancy Almate and uh, Reyes Morota, who definitely has had some early on success, more in the minor leagues, but some early on success, has the movement on his stuff. He just has to be able to control the strike zone uh, in the big league. So the Dodgers continue to have a heck of an offseason, adding more depth to their team and then making the massive splash of getting Freddie Freeman and also one of the more under-the-radar splashes off the bench when it comes to Hans or Alberto, and in the starting rotation when it comes to Danny Duffy. The Dodgers obviously have had an A++ offseason this far. This has been a quick video on the Dodgers absolutely killing the offseason this far. Please continue to subscribe down below, or welcome to Easy Views Widget to keep us growing to 315 by the end of March. We appreciate you guys' support this far. Peace out, everybody, and enjoy the rest of the, well, now it's the spring training, but the MLB still free agency signing period as spring training is going on. Peace out, everybody, and stay safe.